Mabu, hi, this is Bob from Love Beyond the Sea. Stop calling my wife my partner. That's what I'd like to say sometimes, and I'm going to explain what I mean here today. Please subscribe to Love Beyond the Sea. This channel is about marital relationships with a uh, woman from the Philippines. I've been married since 2015, still together over eight years later. And uh, I am very proud that she is my wife. I never thought a day would come when anybody would refer to her as anything less than that. Now I'm going to read something here from uh, an internet source, Mind Body Green. And of course your comments are welcome here. If you feel like I do, or if you feel like it's much ado about nothing, this does bother me. From this source, the word partner is not new. According to Jen Dahl's reporting in the Atlantic, the term arose, this is partner, around the 14th century to connote a more equal relationship between a married man and woman. In comparison to the gendered marriage terms, husband and wife, that have been used since the 11th and 9th centuries, respectively. So um, it's nothing new, but this, what caught my eye here, is equal relationship. In those eight plus years, I've never felt anything but an equal relationship with my wife if we ever talked about this before we got married which is very quick only 54 days I would have said um, of course we're, we're equal here's my perspective as a, as a Christian the Bible says in Philippians 2 verse 3 to regard others as better than ourselves That's that means it's a mindset that it's not all about me I'm not the most important one in here in the world others are that's a Christian attitude because that's the way Jesus lived. He didn't say, well, I am owed this, or I'm not going to do that because I'm so much better than those people are, which he is. He didn't have that mindset. And we shouldn't have that mindset with our wives that we are better or she is better. In fact, anymore, I've learned to just speak up. The other day, I had to check into a, I guess you call it an emergency clinic uh, for some pain in my side. And the, the girl who was going to inject me with some painkiller said, um, what did she say? She was talking about partner and, um, and wife. I should have practiced this before I came on because I was really upset. No, here's what she said. She said, is your partner your wife? Well, that kind of surprised me because usually it's one or the other and you never get any questions about it. So I kind of um, overacted a little bit and I said, huh, of, of, I mean, of course she's my wife. What else could she be? So I was a bad, bad boy there, but you know, I get upset hearing this partner, partner, partner. Uh, no, that's my wife. You can have a partner if you want. I, I have a wife. Also this source here talks about the difference between partner and wife. Both life partners and spouses are in long-term committed relationships. They typically live together and combine their finances. However, spouses are married and marriage is a legal partnership. About that, I want to focus on the word committed. And here they add long-term committed relationship. In my opinion, commitment means marriage. If you're not married, then the, the man or woman, even if they're engaged, still have a right to get out, find somebody better. If somebody comes on that they think, you know, better for them, they can just drop you like a sack of hot potatoes and move on to the next person. Perfectly acceptable. I once asked somebody out on a date and they were engaged and going to be married in two weeks. But you know what? To me, they're not married, there's still an opportunity. Commitment to me means married, legally married ceremony and all that. That's why I don't like to lump my wife, who I have a lot of serious responsibilities to, to something as uh, more frivolous in comparison, you know, a, a boyfriend, girlfriend, they're living together or not living together, who knows? They're just called partner. I think that cheapens a relationship and um, I like marriage better and one more here again leave comments this is uh, love beyond the sea I 
talk about love. Now, can I use partner instead of the wife? Especially when it comes to marriage, some married people might feel that the terms wife or husband have some traditional implications or historical weight that doesn't reflect their relationship. Using partner, on the other hand, is a way to express equity in the relationship with one single word. Why can't equity or equality be the same as wife? My wife will always be a wife, and if I go somewhere, I will always say, what are you talking about? What is this partner business? I'm married. I don't have a partner. I have a wife. I can be that way sometimes, but this um, really bothers me, and um, you're welcome to let me know if, if you have had that thought before. If you're checking out a you know, boxes on a sheet, you have no choice. You know, that's all the way there now, too. Everywhere you go, uh, you do paperwork. It's on there. But if somebody's going to ask me that question, I'm going to make a big stink about it. And that's just the way it is. So how do you feel about this one, partner or wife? Let me know. You're in love beyond the sea.